Hello everyone. If you have ever wondered how your phone seems to know exactly what you're looking for or how cars are learning to drive themselves, you're at the right place. Today we are going to explore how artificial intelligence is not just a buzzword but a real part of our lives, improving the way we work, play and connect with each other. Today we are diving deep into the core components of AI. So what are the methodologies that we will look into? Machine learning, deep learning, natural language processing, computer vision and robotics. Let's start with machine learning. Have you ever wondered how Netflix recommends the perfect shows? Or how your email knows what is spam? The answer is smarter than you think and it is called machine learning. It all starts with a simple idea. Can we predict the future based on the past experiences? Sounds like magic, right? But in fact, it's all about data and patterns. Let me explain it to you with an example. Let us say your friend runs an ice cream shop and has a smart app. This app looks at past sunny days to see how many ice creams were sold. It also checks if today will be sunny. If it is, the app suggests make a lot of ice creams today so that your friend can have enough ice cream for everyone when it is sunny. Let me give you one more example. A doctor could predict a patient's risk of diabetes by feeding clinical data into a machine learning model. This isn't just saving time, it's saving lives. How exactly are machines learning and identifying these patterns? At the core of it, machine learning is a function. Think of it as a super smart equation that takes data, churns through it, and spits out predictions, which we call inferencing. And the process to get there, that is called training. We train the model. During training, we feed system loads of data. This data, or X, is full of features. That's the technical term for the information bits we care about. And the Y, that's the outcome we already know. Our goal is to teach the model to predict Y based on X. Once our model has learned the ropes, it's ready to make predictions on new data. That's where the magic happens. We input new features and our model predicts what the outcome will be called Y hat. Let me give you a real time example. Your music app always knows what songs you love. It's like it makes playlists just for you. This happens because of machine learning. The app watches what songs you enjoy, the beats, the singers, and when you like to listen. This info is the X. If you like a song, that is the Y. The app looks at lots of data about what songs people like and learns from your music style. So when there's new music, it guesses if you will like it or not. That's how machine learning gives your playlists that feel completely personal. Let me explain with another example. E-commerce product recommendations. When you shop online on Amazon or any e-commerce website and you buy a backpack, the website then shows you things like water bottles or camping gear. This is because of machine learning. The website looks at what you and others have shopped for before that's what is the X. It learns what kinds of items usually get bought together. Next time you shop, it guesses what else you might like based on what it has learned, making your shopping experience completely personal and recommending you suggested items along with the product which you are buying. Let me solidify with one final example. Predictive texting in your messages. When you text and your phone guesses the next word, that is machine learning for you. Your texting app keeps track of words you often use together. That is the X. It remembers what word you usually type next. That is the Y. By learning from lots of texts, not just yours, but maybe others too, the app gets good at predicting the next word you might type. That is the Y hat. This makes 
texting quicker and helps stop funny mistakes before they happen. Are you intrigued by machine learning as I am? And if you are hungry for more tech tidbits, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe and ring the bell for notifications of our latest videos. Until next time, keep learning, keep innovating. Thank you.